let's evaluate the integral of 1 divided by cosine of x minus 1. First step is we're going to multiply both the numerator and denominator by cosine of x plus 1 over cosine of x plus 1. So this now becomes the numerator is cosine of x plus 1 and the denominator is cosine squared x minus 1. We go to the identity sine squared x plus cosine squared x equals 1. We see that cosine squared of x minus 1 equals minus sine squared of x. So now we'll replace the denominator with that and the integral now looks like this cosine x plus 1 in the numerator minus sine squared x in the denominator. We'll separate this into two integrals. The first one is minus the integral of cosine of x over sine squared x and the second one is minus the integral of 1 divided by sine squared of x. Next, we're almost done. Next, all we have to do, take a look at the first integral carefully. I'm going to rewrite it like this, cosine x divided by sine x times 1 divided by sine x. So it's the same thing as cosine over sine squared, but in this form, we see that this right here, that is cotangent of x, and 1 over sine is cosecant of x minus 1 over sine squared that's cosecant squared of x and now we'll rewrite the first integral as minus the integral of cosecant x times cotangent x dx minus the integral of cosecant squared x now these two integrals are what we call basic integrals because all we have to do is find the function whose derivative is the respected integral. Uh, most of the time we are working with tangent and secant, but once in a while we work with uh, cotangent and cosecant. Well, in any case, the integral of cosecant x times cotangent x is negative cosecant x. So this is minus a minus cosecant of x. And then minus the integral of cosecant squared x is minus cotangent of x plus c. Once we get rid of the minuses, we'll have our final answer. So the final answer is the integral of 1 divided by cosine x minus 1 is equal to cosecant of x plus cotangent of x plus constant of integration c. 